Then to coverage of the men's doubles final. And I can tell you Shababanyak has already had a quick change of outfit and already has the yellow and orange Phoenix Tech Ball We've Academy. Had lovely weather here this week, some lovely sights. The main square in Pogorica Centre and before that the Millennium Bridge landmark here. Well, the top two seeds have done it again all the way through to the final. Yeah, Nikola Mitro and Bogdanovic beating Adam Blazovic and Adam Bako in the semi finals. Ilyas Shabolts and okay, Abo Georgiak beaten by Balash and Katz. Yeah, I don't know if you saw that semi final, it was a legendary encounter. The first two sets were 12 11, 11 12. Yeah. And then the Serbs came through 12 6 in the third. Be interested to see the reaction for the Serbian team from the Montenegrin crowd here. Seem to be getting pretty excited, don't they? And I can tell you, Bogdan Morovic and Nikola Mitro are looking very animated on the sidelines, as you would expect. They want this one. Martin, she's back from Poland. We'll be overlooking this final. Here we go then. The Serbians are coming out. Nikola Mitro and Bogdan Morovic seem to have the support of the crowd. Haven't quite had the levels that we had for Caroline Greco. But Nikola Mitro and Bogdan Morovic have won nine and eight major titles between them respectively. We'll go into a few more details in a moment's time. Sheba Banyuk has had a quick change of outfit. He's up uh, alongside his esteemed colleague Balash Katz as they look to claim yet another title and of course the back-to-back -back titles after winning in Madrid so it's good to see Nikola Mitro and Bogdanovic back in the final Nikola Mitro 28 years of age sniper style left-footed player representing Tech Ball among nine major titles including two world championships in 2021 and 2022 taking the men's doubles in both consecutive years looking for a first major title of 2023 won gold in Tugu Merez 2022 a gold in LA Paris and Lisbon what was a phenomenal year for those two they were victorious in the 2018 Tech Ball World Championships representing Montenegro at the time. There he is then, Nikola Mitro. A real star of this sport. The sniper style of Tech Ball on display here. Very much dominant with the heads. His teammate Bogdan Morovic, 30 years of age, left footed, also from Tech Ball Amon. Eight major titles, including all of the ones listed there from Nikola Mitro. These two, an absolutely formidable pairing. And, well, I think it's hard to call favourites at this point, but it will be interesting to see how this final pans out. Sheba Banyak, 28 years of age, right-footed, 16 major titles, including men's doubles and mixed doubles in Madrid since 2020, when the rules changed from 24 points per set to 12. Balash Katz playing alongside him, right-footed, eight major titles in recent history, gold and men's doubles in Madrid, Dubai, LA, Skorka this year, LA and Budapest last year, Krakow World Series and okay, Los well, we'll Angeles last year. So those are your teams, your four players. Nikola Mitro looks pumped, often the player that you will see the best of when team in he's black, team in yellow, steamed team in up. Yellow to serve. Mirovic will be the voice of calm in these two players it is Banyak to get us underway with that sweeping right foot First serve service. how's it going to be pumping after that mixed doubles final Banyak to get us underway there's the serve Morovic gets down low turns the fence into attack Morovic returns that Banyak serve so well Banyak with the smash 
Mitro, back to Morovic, Chester back into play. Mitro is in a good defensive position now. Katz back to Banyak, who drops it short. And Mitro and finds the middle of the table as an illegal oh, attack. In, in the and the point goes to Hungary, and this is going to be a feisty affair. Yeah, it certainly is. Usually uh, pretty fired up, the Serbs in particular. They've had a few disciplinary problems along the way, but they get themselves really in the zone and fired up. First service. So Banyak with one out of one so far on the serves. Morovic so good at returning Four. that Banyak serve. He's a specialist in the Banyak serve. And that sniper style does Second lend service. itself towards absorbing power. In comes that serve from Banyak. Morovic managed to get it up high. Back to Morovic who attempts a left foot swinging smash. It never looks confident. And returning the serve well, but struggling to mount an attack with their own Mitro. And Morovic yet First to get service. packing in this men's doubles final. Banyak with a serve. Mitro back to Morovic. Morovic has to get down low. It's another That's mistake from Morovic. And it's three already, now on the Banyak serve. Yeah, Mitro's already pretty angry there. They, they got into a position where they returned the serve. And lost the point, threw it away a bit the last two. Banyak with the serve. Morovic with the snipe. It's not power, it's precision, and it's a first point for the Serbians and the crowd response. Chain serves, team in black to serve. Yeah, Tech Molly Man and the sport that they grew up with playing originally involved a First lot service. of heading and that's why they are experts at it. So Banyak now with a chance to smash this. Mitro yeah. runs out of space. Yeah. Could have done with Metro a couple of yards there and Hungary is starting very well here. It's the Morovic serve. In it comes, oh. it's long. Morovic so aggressive. They've entered four tournaments this year and they've won them all. Second 24 service. successive victories coming into this match. Yeah. 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 Banyak himself is on now a 14 match winning streak in all competitions. Something's got to give. Yeah. After but victory in that mixed doubles final. Yeah, Chava Banyak and Balash Katz do lead this head to head 3 1. Four. Which surprised me a little. At one point, Second, Mitra and Mirojevic were all conquering. Yeah, they were dominating for a while, weren't they? But they've changed up Banyak and Blazovic, no longer playing together. And oh. 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 Mitro does not look happy with Bogdan. <laughs> Been together for so long, this pair First know each other inside out. Four. So. Second this is uh, a, a strong start from the Hungarians. The Serbians yet to get started. Banyak with a smash. Mitro does well to keep that alive. Rolovic just can't quite handle it round. And Mitro looks furious already, by the way. 7 1. Banyak and Katz. Clean sweep for Rolovic. Serve there, James. Yeah. They've only taken one point. That was off the Banyak serve. First service. So Katz now. Serves into the net. Can they put a bit of pressure on this cat serve? They're going to need to, otherwise this first set is going to go by in a flash. Not Second the final they expected so far. Serbians yet to quite get oh, going. That's a cat's four. fault from Katz. And you must feel Katz watching the Banyak serve. Probably comes under a little bit of pressure, doesn't he? First Thinks, well, I've got to try and keep up with Banyak. Played so well in Madrid, though, oh. didn't he? He's a great foil, great defence. Hustle service. around the table, isn't he? So it's low. But they like to play low sometimes. Mitro managed to get his head. Banyak with a chance for a smash. It's too good. Oh, it's too good. It's out yeah. the uh, arena. Marojevic asking if that was an illegal attack over halfway, but they haven't challenged. No, I don't think it was either. I think it was more out of hope than anything else. Sometimes referee gives an indicator as to whether or not it's worth First a challenge. Service. So close to call sometimes. Out. Second service. Second serve then from Katz. So much work to do though. Well, another captain's fault. And well, Serbians sensing an opportunity now to keep that pressure up. It's two double faults First in a row. Two captain's faults for Katz. Oh, brilliant from Mitro. And they found their way back into this set now. Yeah, needed that, didn't they? Chain serves, team in black to serve. But two double faults in your four serves. Is a First cardinal sin in this sport. Yep. Mitro. Now we're looking to 
second service. Continue this momentum from the Serbs. It's three points lost on the uh, cat serve. Tries to make up for it with a smash. Mitro's there, Morovic snipe header out wide. Katz is going to have to do something miraculous to get this back. He nearly pulls it off. And it's a head and hands moment for Banyak for the first time this match. And slowly, Mitro and Morovic are growing into this. And even if they don't make their way into this set, you feel the second set could be a little bit more competitive. It's now three, row, three points in a row for Mitro and Morovic. And Mitro slaps his own leg from a first serve. Faults, which shows you the passion that he feels. Service. Winds himself up, and we feel you get the best out of Nicholas Mitro when he's stressed. Katz. Clever that from Katz because the smash would have been difficult from that angle. Look for a second, like it might be short there from Mitro, like it was there from Banyek. And Morovic is playing singles for a second there, returned the ball without passing it over to his colleague. Just couldn't get underneath it. Mitro asking if it was deliberate and Morovic like as if I'd do something like that. Well, at the end of this service routine, it is the Banyak serve again. Morovic is service. good at getting that back, but still, it's such a weapon. So, all looking good for the Hungarians at the moment. Katz sets himself up for the smash. Morovic returns with the sniped header. Up high by Katz, it's going to go wide. And the Serbians are clawing their way back into this. I still don't think they're going to make it back in well, this second set. Five out of the last set. seven points, James, and uh, it's still so much more to do, especially with Banyak, so yeah. to come, as you said. Oh, the Banyak serve is the weapon that no one wants to come up against. First service. Mitro. We're looking to finish on a high here. Net. Clips the top of the net. It will be a second serve now. Second service. Here we go. Katz with the smash. Yeah! Oh, that's brilliant from Katz, by the way. I thought for a second it looked like it might have crossed the line, but there was no protest from the Serbians. And now, at 10-6 down, it is the cheat code in tech ball, the banning serve. There comes the serve from Banyak. Mitro's done brilliantly there. Morojevic smashes it home. That is brilliant from the Serbians. Take your hat off. No, not when to be defeated. Nikola Mitro working hard. And that was a huge point for them to win. Can that change a bit of momentum? Watch this from Nikola's Mitro. And even Chela Banyak applauded that one as well. Turn round. First of all, chance of Serbia around the Verdi Arena. Four. Banyak wanted to get that over. Stop oh. this uh, sound from this crowd. Not much to cheer about, really, have they? 7 1, remember, but since then, 6 out of 9 points. Just a bit of pressure. Second service. So, Banyak with the second serve. Chance now for Morovic to smash it home. And the Serbians are using that chance of Serbia to really start to get some momentum here and they're back to within two it's a strange first set this they're feeding off it aren't they energy for the serb pair here atmosphere growing first service. they look locked in here great serve from banyak again Morovic with the header it's interesting because Mitro was all over the other side of the court there once again oh, Morovic oh, into the net yeah. and banyak and Katz organizing themselves so well there Nikola Mitro had to get out of the way. Banya complained, they still kept composed. Bizarre first set this. Good job they won that point, otherwise set there might have been some real controversy. Yeah, yeah. So you can't challenge a player in the way. Set points. Crowd might be a little quieter if Chava gets this serve right. Great serve once again, but Morovic is there. There's a the snipe header. Banyak lofts it up high. Play back in by Katz. Banyak with the smash. Mitro is there. Morovic plays himself up. There's a smash from Morovic. Oh, wow. Into the knees of Banyak. Set point saved. Wow. They were just looking, wondering whether it was an edge ball. So they've survived the Banyak serve. It's now on to Morovic. Chubbs, chance of Serbia. Ringing around. First service. Cheva Banyak won just arena. one point out of four. Oh. That's bizarre. And Mirojevic has found a way Second of countering service. that Banyak serve. But we are back oh. on set one point. And it's a captain's fault to end the first set. 
Well, it was somewhat of a bizarre first set. Momentum switching. Banyak losing service points, which you don't often see. And in the end, it seems appropriate that it is settled with a Bogdan Morovic captain's bowl. Hungary take the first set 12 7, the 12 9. Yeah, 24 match winning streak this season for Mitro Morovic under real pressure now, bidding for their fifth title out of five. But 17 career titles for Banyak and Katz, and they're looking good again. Raced into a 7 1 lead. It got a little edgy after that as the momentum went with this Serbian pair. But in the end, the double fault proved costly. We're in Pogorica, if you're just joining us. Where have you been? You've missed four of the five finals. Maybe the best is yet to come. We've got 10 seconds left. Let's just have a look at that final point. How the set was conceded, the pressure getting to Marojevic. Oldest player on the court at 30 years of age. So, the Serbians make their way back out. The crowd have woken up again. Marojevic and Mitro getting full support as we look at the statistics from that first set and not enough service points won for Mitro Morovic a chance then for them to improve on that and maybe push this to a deciding set it's Morovic to get us underway Out. Serbia Serbia second the chance of the crowd second serve for Morovic Katz up high Slice smash from Katz. Mitro has definitely crossed the line there and knows it. First service. Katz with another chance to hit the smash. It's an edge ball. And I'll tell you what, we don't talk enough about the Katz smash because that is so consistent out wide there. Just about clips the edge of the table. First service. Comes to serve. Katz. Getting louder again. Oh, and it's not gone to his teammate. Yeah. Illegal return there from Morovic. And Hungary have taken two points out First of Morovic's serve already. Katz with the smash. It's so clever from Katz. Banyak slaps his head, implying good thinking, well thought, clever play from Alash Katz, who is a very intelligent player, so has to be said. Mirror image of the first set so far, first three points first went to the Hungarians. Out. Still the crowd stick with their heroes. 3-0. This could be a clean sweep on the Morovic serve. Katz with a chance to smash this home. Drops it short. Mitro, Chester to Morovic. Morovic with a snipe header. And it's an edge ball. No, it's not. It's good. Uh, it was an edge ball. Oh. Oh. Well, the celebrations are cut short. Harsh. Edge ball. What? Oh. Edge ball. Oh, Mitro is like, now. no chance, yeah. mate. I'm <laughs> seeing that again. What was the. Edge ball. I didn't think it was. Looked good. We're not at a good angle to see, to be honest. I, I thought that was good, to be fair. Not straight away, Martin indicated edge ball let's have a look at the replay yeah, look, yeah no deviation down the line. no deviation no at all in the ball that yeah. was what was the killer for me Mitro looks frustrated but they've not lost anything from this so they keep their challenge and they keep the point yep well they get the point don't they they'll be overturned surely well it's one point on the Mroyevich so serve it's not enough no it's now Banyak if Banyak smashes Black. four but again challenge remains so Mroyevich is so good at returning the Banyak serve let's see how uh, Mitro gets on Change now serves to mean yellow to serve Morovic was taking all four of them, all eight of them, should I say, from that first serve. First service. Here we go then, first serve from Banyak. Four. Smashed into the net. Cheering the missed first serve. Well, so, so, but such we is the weight that is carried in the Banyak second first service. serve. But, but we saw the second serve look absolutely incredible in the mixed doubles. Let's see if he can do it again here. Oh, it's ridiculous, but Mitro is there. Brilliant from Mitro. Banyak sets himself up for the smash. Mitro once again there. Mrojevic out wide. Oh, it's great technical this small players. Katz has crossed the line. Still did well to make contact with the table. Brilliant point all round. But Mrojevic and Mitro are alive. 2-3. Well, they've done what they didn't manage to do in the first set. They got a point back at 3-1, then lost four more in a row. And they just 
had too much to do. Now, though, they've got it within a point, and Banyan has lost four of his last five on serve. He has, but that is a brilliant serve, and there's nothing that either Morovic or Mitro can do about that, because Morovic chased it down. Mitro made the initial contact, which has carried the momentum of the ball back onto the wrong side of the table. First service. So, Banyak picking up a couple of points here. Four. Lost ball. Let's take a little while to retrieve this. Sort of unofficial timeout now, which puts more pressure on that second Banyak serve. Yeah, Chaba Banyak and Alash Katz overcame Apo Georgiak, the supreme second singles service. player at the moment in the semi finals with his partner Sabolch Ilyesh. Straight so, sets. Banyak now with a second serve, a long pause between that first and second serve. Still, he managed to get a good serve back. Mitro has a chance to attack there. This is clever from edge Mitro, ball. it's an edge ball. Yeah. He knows because the that, chance side, that side of the table is open. Shouldn't be replaying this point. Should have been 4 3. Should have been. First service. And it's another first serve for Banyak. Edge, edge ball. ball. And he thought he'd won that point. He's thinking of the challenge, but goes, now. Nah, let's hold on. I've I got a bit edge. more, potentially another set, even if we don't win this one. I thought edge as well, to be fair. So Banyak will get first serve. another first serve. And it comes. Mitro with the snipe header. Clever that from Banyak. He's kept it alive. But a chance now for Rovic oh. to attack. Well, they still have a challenge oh, because well they, they won the last challenge. You can see the reaction of Morovic. convinced that was a winner. I felt edge ball personally, but Morovic is convinced. Yeah, he's, he's really almost persuading convinced. me because I thought it was edge. But g given how adamant he was it does make oh. me feel no nah, that's an edge ball if you ask me we need another frame and we need a side angle almost yeah. don't we that's a tough one to call you the side angle i think that's an edge ball is there enough evidence to overturn it looks i think no I goodness think me no. I well, think this no. is gonna upset no. somebody challenge completed no edge ball point for team in blue oh wow well, that's Quite controversial, but that's the second VAR decision that's gone the way of the Serbians. And that was a difficult one. I'm not sure there was enough evidence to overturn that, but probably just in their favour. First service! Shabba Banyak will concede the point and go again with another serve. In it comes. Morovic back to Mitro. Mitro heads it to the middle of the table. Katz, Banyak with a smash. Oh, brilliant. Ah! From Mitro Morovic to try and turn edge this around. Ball. An edge ball and hungry <laughs> celebrate because they survived. And they're not going to appeal this one. They've challenged the last two edge balls, not this time. No. Chapa's under pressure though on his serve. Two out of the last five. Well, don't forget the Serbians dominated for so long, which will have required getting a lot oh. of those Chapa Banyak serves back. Morovic into the net. And Mitro is fuming because he felt the opportunity was there. He had done so well, hadn't he? An outrageous knee back across. It was almost perfect. It was good. He set some up. I think Brojevic could have settled for just maybe keeping the point alive rather than going for the winner. It was the wrong service. shot choice from Brojevic. Mitro bouncing the ball up and down. Change the serve. In comes the serve. Katz sets up Banyak. Banyak with the smash. Mitro sucks it back up. Brojevic back to Mitro. Heads to the middle of the table. Katz to Banyak. Oh, and that's illegal attack. an illegal attack and from Katz. And Serbia are clawing their way back into the second set. We'd love to see a starting set here. Crowd would love to as well. Net. Second service. Second serve now for Mitro. In it comes. Katz, chest it. Banyan with the smash out of the arena. And that is what the Phoenix Setball Academy likes to see. A Banyan sweeping right foot smash. No one in the world's getting that back unless you're 10 foot 10. And they restore a two point lead. Mitro still serving here. In comes that serve, Katz does well. Banyak with another chance for a smash. Edge ball. And it's an edge ball. I'll tell you what, the referees are being worked hard here, aren't they? So many edge balls.
Fair service. So in comes serve from Mitro. Banyak with the smash is out of the and arena again. In yellow. And Banyak is starting to put a big, good bit of momentum here. Yeah, we said earlier, didn't we, that when the men's doubles and mixed doubles came on, he'd be hitting them not just out of the playing surface, Fair but service. to the back, far side of the arena, and that's just what he's been doing. Cats. Chester up high, another chance for a Banyak smash. Mitro's on the tail end of that one though, absorbs it with his head, turns it back around with the snipe header. Cats, Chester, Banyak, head, middle, Mitro gets there, Mrojevic, wide, and Hungary celebrates it like they've taken the title. Big point for them there, and they're now just four points away, and they know that that one was a big one. Change serve. Had to serve, change, and yeah. it's now the Cats serve. Cats will be wanting to avoid those two captain's faults that greeted his first service point in the previous set and it isn't anything like it, a completely different narrative. Cats with a near ace, Mrojevic can only just make contact to it and Hungary are on track here for victory. 9-4 they lead in the second set. Four Cats points in a row to the Hungarians. Cats serving, in comes that serve, it's the same place as the last one. Mitro to Mrojevic, Mrojevic for the snipe header, Banyak just about gets a tap to it, played back in beautifully by Katz and Banyak chests it back into play. Mitro back to Mrojevic, Mrojevic with a smash of his own, anything you can do Shava, I can do too. And Mrojevic replies and keeps this match alive. Mitro trying to fire his teammate up and need to put pressure on this Katz serve if this match is to live to another set. Out. Out. So Katz with two great Second serves service. to start with. First fault of the service routine. In comes the next serve. Mitro plays it back to Mrojevic, who just tinks the ball back in it, just about make contact at the end of the table. A chance for a Banyak smash. He gets his foot beautifully oh, over that one. Mitro. Fires it out the arena, yeah, and Mitro they're just two hurt. away. He's hurt himself there. He crashed into the hoardings trying to get to it. Just having a look at him. So we're just potentially two points away. We might see on the replay what happened there to Mitro. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's crashed into the barrier. In. He'll he's be all right. It's up. honestly not the first time that Nikola Mitro has crashed into no, the barriers before in Helmand, uh, Poland, and uh, I think it was a start one of the first Tech Ball tours. First uh, Nikola Mitro clattered the side quite catastrophically, but was okay then, and he's okay now. And there's a mistake from Mrojevic, and that sets up match points for Banyak and Katz. And He's got injured as well. I don't know whether it was the ball, ball or whether he Marovic hit the table with his face. Has but taken a class of there. He's in a bit of pain there. I think Do he might time? have just caught the table. I think he smacked his nose, isn't he? Yeah, it's his nose that's a problem. I don't know whether it was ball or table, but he was well done. Time. straight away. Oh, it's Ouch. table. Time for Team in Black. Yeah, yeah, that was a sore one, wasn't it? And at match point, I mean, I don't think it's going to change the outcome of this match personally, but more of its grimaces. And it just shows you how much you're putting on the line with that sniper style. Thankfully, it's not a nosebleed. It's time out, though. And it's, uh, and look how relaxed Shadow Banyak is, by the way. Yeah, well, it's just chilled. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, 53 titles now. You're allowed to enter two disciplines. And he did a clean sweep in Madrid. And it looks odds on now he's going to do a clean sweep again here in Podgorica, Montenegro. Yeah, it's a 14 match winning streak in major competitions. That, of course, includes that ball tour, World Series, and World Championships that Shabbabanyak is on. But it's it, like he'll extend it to 15 here. James, it's since the change of partner for Shabbabanyak, since he partnered with Balash Katz, that the dominance that Mitro Morovic has has been ended. They're twice world champions, they were winning almost everything, but now the momentum has switched. And we said the head to head between these two teams is 3 to 1 in favour of the Hungarians. Timers, surely it's before 1, surely. Yeah. And, I mean, nothing against. Adam Blazovic, who is one of the best football players in the world, it's just the style of catch yes, seems to really complement the Banyaks. Like totally it. Well, Bako and Blazovic are a great pairing as well, so, you know, the, these two, Blazovic and Banyak, were great Timinero. players, but they need to part service. ways. They might come back together again at another point. Mrojevic serves, though, at match point, recovers from that nose. Cats with the smash down the middle. Mitro's there. Mrojevic back to Mitro. Mitro's in trouble here, and it goes wide, and there it is, the championship to... Shabobanyak and Balash Katz who embrace in the middle of the arena. And Commiserations the to Bogdan Mrojevic and Nikola Mitro. It's good to see them back in finals, but they came up against formidable opponents. 
and Bashkaz with the celebration. I think he's possibly taken that from Blazovic, but it's good celebrations from both those players. And congratulations to the Hungarians. They are the champions. Preeminent. Uh, Banyak is just in the form of his life. And I asked him after Madrid, is that the best you've ever played? And he, he was taken surprised by the question. But then said, yeah, it probably is actually. Yeah, well, he's matched that again today. He's keeping on this peak. And the big question now will be with a two-month gap, can he continue and take it into the European games? Because it means so much to the European players here this week. A little bit of an explainer from that Balash Katz uh, celebration there. So Adam Blazovic says, you need to help us come up with a celebration. And the celebration for uh, Blazovic was going to be taking the shoe off and putting it on your head. Katz has taken it a step further and has taken a dial uh, of the phone on his boot. So it's very entertaining to see these little sub stories behind the scenes. Here we go then. Match statistics. Nikola Mitro and Bogdan Morovic beaten by Shabavanyak and Balash Katz. And you can see across the board there, unforced errors 12 from the Serbians, nine winners from the Hungarians. And that leads nicely into the award ceremony. Up onto the stage come our athletes, Mr. Milos Antic, Assistant Secretary of Culture and Sports of Pogdrisa. And he will be handing over the trophies to the deserved winners. But commiserations, good to see them back in the final. Bogdan Morovic and Nikola Mitra, no doubt about it. We will see them back, I'm, I'm sure, on the top step uh, competition soon as attention will turn to the European Games, which will take place in a couple of months' time. The next major tech ball event. It's been a busy start to the year on the tech ball calendar. And, the winners, the gold of the and taking yet another title. This team is looking formidable. Shababanyak and Balash Katz are ridiculous. They are two of the stars of this game right now, and they can't stop winning. And it's not just that they won today, it's not just they won in straight sets, they conceded only 14 points across two sets to the team that was acknowledged by everyone as the best in the world by some distance just a year ago. Yeah, it's a good point. So, they've done it here in Montenegro. Congratulations to Balas Gats and to Sheba Banyik, who take yet another title. This team is proving to be the one to beat. And the momentum truly with this Hungarian pairing representing the Phoenix Tech Ball Club. And that concludes the action here in Montenegro. It's been a great few days, Tim. Oh, it certainly has. Formerly known as Tito Grad, Pogorica has been a willing and excellent host Let's just have a look at how this final event came to its conclusion. So that's another Tech Ball European Tour event almost done and dusted. From James and myself, we'd like to say thanks very much for joining us again. Hungary, again, preeminent. Four out of the five trophies go their way. 12 weeks to wait until the European Games in Krakow. You know it'll be worth the wait. See you there.
Jacket and win the championship.